guys and welcome to MIDI's Tech Circle. In today's video I want to show you the application from Samsung which is called Samsung Flow which is available in the Microsoft Store on Windows 10 and in the Play Store or in the um, Galaxy App Store. So yeah, in this video I just want to show you what you can do with this tool and how useful and productive you can use it. So first of all, I want to show you how to set up and connect both devices. So first of all, of course, you need to download Samsung Flow from the Play Store and from the Microsoft Store. So let's launch both applications. And um, as you will see, you get an introduction, how to pair it. And here you can click to get more um, information. Um, to connect this device, you will have or you will be right, redirected from the Samsung Flow app to a web page from Samsung to install some drivers so that this can work. And yeah, so let's click on pair. And here you can see that my uh, laptop will search over Bluetooth for devices. So Bluetooth is a requirement on your PC or Windows 10 device. Without Bluetooth, it will not work. So here it says searching for Bluetooth devices and here Medis Galaxy S7 Edge is ready to pair. So let's tap on pair and then you get a prompt let Samsung Flow pair your device. Then we tap on yes. Then we have to check the pass key if it's the right one on both devices. So we tap yes on both. You will see a progress bar how um, the progress is with um, the pairing. Here we get a message setting up a device, so this is normal. So now you will have to register your device. So this is an interesting point because now it will verificate that it's you again. So here you have to confirm the passcode on both devices. Okay, all right, so we have done this. Now it will ask you for your pin code or your password of your device. So the pin or the password which you um, always lock on your PC. So I type in my password and then it gives you a prompt to safely use Samsung Flow, set a strong Windows 10 password. So we hit OK because we know that, that we have to use it. Then you get a message here, complete re registration. And here it asks you if Unlock and sign in to connected devices with your biometrics using Samsung Pass. So this is nice because um, it depends on which uh, Samsung Galaxy phone you are using. So mine just support biometrics with fingerprint, but the S9 and Note 8 and S8 are using also iris scan and facial recognition. So let's hit OK. Then you will see that it's processing something. And then you will get a message from Samsung Pass, use your fingerprints to verify your identity. So I just put my thumb here and you can see that now my I'm verified here and now our session is started. So here you can also send a message to your PC for example. So you will see that um, it's here as a message and yeah so let's dig in into the um, options you have here. So basically you can here over this attach symbol, you can send everything you have on your phone to the PC. So let's say we want to send a video from, let's say this Avenger trailer. We select done, then you see that it's connecting and boom, it says also connecting here on your PC. And the device or um, the file should be then um, or should be sent instantly. So the nice thing about Samsung Flow is that if you are sending smaller files, for example, three megabytes um, for from a song or a, a music MP3 file, this will send the file over Bluetooth. So again, here a uh, prompt. And when you are sending bigger files, so 200 megabyte. And again here a prompt, let's connect. And you will send uh, bigger files, which are maybe 300 or 500 megabyte big. Then it will send it over Wi-Fi direct. For example, here 30 megabytes, 
it, you can see that it sends it over Wi-Fi direct. So you will see here the symbol and um, it shows us that it's sent over Wi-Fi direct. So you can see that it, it is pretty fast by sending a file which is um, 30 or maybe 40 megabyte um, large. And here you can open now up this file on your PC. So this is really useful if you just want to transfer some files from your Galaxy device to Samsung Flow. So um, I like this a lot because it could be sometimes really useful. And here you can see that we have our trailer now on our laptop. So this is great. So. This is a really nice program. But the biggest or the nicest feature in my opinion is the one because we have saved the, um, the um, biometrics on our phone. When we lock the device, you will see what will happen. So we locked our device. And here you can see swipe up or press spacebar to sign in with me this Galaxy S7 Edge. So we press the spacebar on our PC. Then you will see no sign in options, but here you will see instant that Samsung Pass opens up. And look, when I'm now entering my, or giving my fingerprint here on my Galaxy F7 Edge, what will happen here is that I'm signing in to my PC without having to type in the password or pin I'm using on my device. So this is really nice. This is one of my really um, favorite features of Samsung Flow to register just with your biometrics on your phone into your PC. So this is great. So that's a nice feature you have there. Also cool things are that here you can see all your notifications you get on your Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge they will be listed up here. Also, for example, if you are getting a WhatsApp message, you can directly re reply them here as a toast message or a pop-up. You can reply them. And here you can have a view, an overview of all your notifications you have received here on your phone. And if you delete them there or clear them all, they will also be cleared here. Also in the other way, if I clear here all my notifications, they will be cleared here in Samsung Flow also. So this is Samsung Flow. Of course, you can do also some things like um, you go to a web page, for example, this uh, Samsung Update Tracker, and you share a web page. So let's wait that it's okay. So let's share this web page with Samsung Flow. And here you can see that the link was shared. So we can directly go to the web page on our PC. Isn't that great? That's really nice. So this could really be productive in your day-to-day -day use. So I, I like Samsung Flow a lot and I really recommend it to everyone who, um, who wants to have a connection between his mobile phone, his Samsung Galaxy phone and his PC to um, transfer data, to send um, websites or to look, take a look on websites you have found on your device. But also the other way is possible that you send a website, I think, from Microsoft Edge to Samsung Flow. This is also a possibility. So here you can see Samsung Flow. I tap on this, then share content with your connected phone via Samsung Flow. My phone is listed up here and you can see that I got this, yeah, this uh, website here on my Galaxy S7 Edge and I can also view it. So you can see you have many, many possibilities here with Samsung Flow. So um, yeah, that's it. That's Samsung Flow. It's free to use. Um, remember, you will have to um, have a laptop which um, supports Bluetooth and then you're good to go. This will work seamlessly for you. So definitely check it out if you have a Samsung phone. I think you will have to need um, or you need uh, Android 6.0 or higher to use this and try everything out on your own and you will see that this could be really handy in your day-to-day -day usage. 
I hope this video helped you a lot and uh, you might uh, thought this video was useful then please give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and I would say yeah have a great day and I hope to see you soon here back on Medi's tech circle bye peace everyone